could you introduce yourself first? Hi everyone, I'm Jacinta from Singapore. Uh, I have been coming to Naju since 2017. We went to the Blessed Mountain first and by God's grace and Mama Mary's grace, uh, we actually met the sisters of Naju while we were alone in the mountain at the Blessed Mountain. So we felt very humble with by it and it became a yearly trip that we make to Naju except for COVID period. Since my son was born in 2019, we have been having trouble with our house and with him. So when my son was one year old, in 2020, he started to know how to talk and he started telling us that he doesn't want Hemuni, he doesn't want to go back to follow Hemuni home and he does. He keeps telling us that he has seen Hemuni even though he has not seen my mother-in-law or my father-in-law at all. So sometimes, you know, my son would say that he hears bells and that is Hemuni ringing the bell calling him to come, just like some shaman uh, asking souls to come to their house. So uh, it actually scares us, but not knowing whether this was the correct thing and with the attacks that he getting worse and worse, we actually show him a family photo of my husband's family. However, he was able to, when he saw the, my husband's family photo, he immediately pointed at my mother-in-law and screamed and shouted and went to hide in a corner saying, uh, Himuni, Shiro, Shiro, I I don't want to follow you home. So we have never taught him uh, the Korean word for Hemuni because my husband uh, left our family in 2018 before my son was born because of his mother. And sometimes during the attacks, my son would tell us that uh, this is not my God. This is, uh, I don't want and I, I need help, save me, help me. And the attacks occur every night from at 9 o'clock at night and then midnight will be in our timing 2 a.m. and then we'll wake up again at 6 o'clock because he would be disturbed and at 8 a.m. before he go to school so each time the attacks happen our house would be very dusty uh, the altar will also become very dusty uh, we reached out to the sisters of Naju and we bought the, plank, the blessed blanket of Mama Mary for my son Timothy to sleep. So the first night when he actually slept in that blanket, he slept really well. And we felt so good because we had a good night's sleep. So each time the attacks happened, we would cover him with the blanket. We would spray holy water around it and he would come down. However, it did not happen at a time, the attacks didn't happen at a time that he was sleeping. <laughs> and we reach out to uh, the sisters again for help. And this time they tell us to, uh, they suggested that we actually uh, invite Jesus mercy or glory into our house. So we receive Jesus mercy or glory and we open it, we smell a very strong sense of rose and we felt very humble by it. And we hung Jesus on mercy of glory up and each time my son Timothy is affected by the spiritual attacks caused by uh, mother-in-law, we would bring him in front of Jesus on mercy of glory and call him for help and say, look at Jesus, Jesus is looking at you, Jesus will help you. We help him, we set him in front of it, we make him sit in front of Jesus on mercy of glory and we actually started praying and his attacks subsided. So a few months back, my mom actually, and she saw a vision of Jesus on mercy of glory with his light shining brightly in our house and he actually, it spread throughout the house and when we came back, the house felt so different and from then on, together with praying that we recite in front of Jesus mercy of glory, the intensity of the attacks were lesser. So the only thing that we can only do is only to pray that my son's grandmother, Hemuni, does will stop disturbing and harassing us with her evil spirits, her evil intentions, and her evil spells. Jacinta knows that her mother-in-law regularly visits a shaman for help, and she had seen a picture of her husband's family visiting a shaman. 
Could you also share the graces your son received when he wore the All Signs of Grace clothing? Oh yes, so we actually purchased the All Signs of Grace clothes for him to wear at night. So sometimes my son Timothy will actually request to wear it and he actually feels much more comfortable, he sleeps well with it. Of course when he wears it, you know, we have a peaceful night at on that day. Because without your protection, without Mama Julia's prayers and the miraculous water of Naju and the miraculous items of Naju, we would have a much harder time. Of course, we also pray that you also continue to protect him from his grandmother who continues to do it until she stops. Thank you, Mama Julia, for your prayers. Thank you. I most importantly thank you the Lord and the Blessed Mother of Junaju for helping us and for always protecting Timothy. Amen. Yes. <laughs>